Hey everyone, I'm Des. Okay, so I'll be completely honest. I don't know what to film for my first video because my personality is just everywhere. So I thought that I'll probably just do an Ipsy video because I enjoy getting Ipsy every month. I enjoy the products and I don't really want to be like a beauty guru kind of like that, but it was just one of those things that I figured I would take it and run with it for my first video. Um, so yeah. Let's get started. Okay, so this is February's Ipsy bag for this month. I really like this one a lot better than last month's. Last month's bag looked kind of like a blue, like, tarp material, and I didn't really personally like it. Um, this one has kind of, like, a cool geometric design to it, and it's pink and a gray color. Um, the thing with Ipsy is that every time it gives you, like, your glam room and everything like that, I've noticed that like I'll be searching through the things on scrolling down my computer and I'll be like I really don't like what I was getting like it was not matched to my personality or the test that you get you have to take on there you have to take like a little quiz to get your stuff and I personally didn't like anything that was online but I was like okay I'll wait till it gets here and then when it got here I opened it up and I thought it was really cute and I actually liked the stuff in it so that's always a big plus. It's only $10 a month, so for the stuff you get, you get five samples or five, um, you get like two full products or something like that. There's some sort of ratio. I don't know everything. So I guess I'll just get started with the products that were inside the bag. They give you this little card that says hashtag Ipsy Love. And there's like a little description on the back. We don't need that. Uh, let's see. The first thing I got was this blush by Model & Co. It's called Peach Bellini, and it is kind of like a peachy color with gold flecks in it. I personally really liked the color of this one. I was hoping I was going to get this color because I've never gotten like a peach color before. I'm sorry, I'm shooting on my iPhone, so it's probably going to be terrible video quality. Just bear with me in my awkward first stages of filming. Um, the thing with this blush, I tried it out. I actually have it on today, but just very lightly. Um, is There's a lot of fallout. Like, as soon as I touched my brush to it like it went everywhere but I really do enjoy the packaging on this because it is so pretty and it, I feel like it's very very chic and I really liked the color payoff it was very pigmented uh, I guess the only thing that I didn't like was just that it had so much fallout which really I don't think you can fix in any way there might be like something I can do to make it a little bit better but overall I really did enjoy it and it is a full-size product I believe the second thing I got were these Glam Glow Bright Mud Eye Treatments. And they're like really iridescent. It's like freaking my camera out. Um, they say they're for one use only. And they are like these little tiny pods that you take out. I have not tried this yet. So I'm really excited to see how this works. I know that Glam Glow does like a lot of mud treatments and facial treatments and... Things like that. The directions say to tap on, wait three minutes, and then wipe off. So it seems easy enough. I'll have to like get back to you on how this stuff works. Though so, uh, I don't know if my eyes need any brightening or not. We're gonna give it a try. Uh, next thing I got was a NYX eye slash eyebrow pencil in the shade Gold, which I was really happy I got this shade because I saw they had like crystal and silver and gold, and gold's one of my favorite shades to try out. Um, I've had NYX eye pencils before and I really like them. They're a very creamy and smooth consistency. So it's not like trying to put like a shard of glass to your eye. Because I have had experiences like that. Where the eyeliner was very, very hard and oh, no bueno. So I'll give you a little like swatch. You can tell on my skin I'm like so pale. So pale. This, it's kind of, it shows up yellow on the camera, but really it's, it's sparkly and has gold in it. It's more like a yellowy gold. I really like it. I'm going to have to give that one a try. I haven't tried this yet. And NYX, I always really like their products. I've never had any problems with them. Let's see, the next thing I got was a Mitchell and Peach facial oil thing, or Fine Radiance Face Oil. That sounds fancy. Uh, it says a light oil with natural antioxidants and vitamins to use massage two to three drops onto skin alone or under your moisturizer. I haven't tried this, but I smelled it earlier and ooh, it smelled good. 
It's like a light florally smell. I can smell a lot of lavender. It has like coconut oil, apricot kernel oil, sunflower oil, grapeseed oil, jojoba. I don't know how you pronounce that word. I am sorry. But it is really, really good smelling. The good thing about this is I noticed when I opened it, it has this little like dispenser that you just like drop onto your skin and there's like, it gives you like a little amount of oil, which I think is really helpful because I'd be afraid if this didn't have any thing in it, I'd just dump it all over and it'd be done with. Uh, the last thing I got, I was most excited about because you will find out from watching me. Oh gosh, my camera's like doing some sort of freaking out thing. It's like, cha. I'm sorry. Uh, I was really excited about this because I love, 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 love lip products. So they sent me this City Color Creamy Lip Stain in the shade Flirtini. Now I don't know if this is like from the same people as LA Colors because it seems like it has the same font, but I don't really care. I've never had a bad product from them. And it is this nice like deep pink mauve color. And I can try it on for you guys. I'll just swatch it on here for now. It is like this nice pink color. I had it on my lips earlier, but I took it off. I'm like putting this in the wrong direction of the camera. I am so sorry. But, um, yeah. I really liked the color. And I had it on my lips and it felt very smooth and creamy. And it, I tried um, eating with it. And it, not a lot of it came off. Just like a little bit. And I've had so many lipsticks where like the whole thing just came off your mouth while you're eating. And sometimes there's just no use. But overall, I really enjoyed this month's bag. I mean, every time I look online, I feel like I don't like it on the screen. But as soon as I get it, I really enjoy the products that are in it. So it's one of those things you just kind of have to try. I think it was a good value. I got, you know, a lip product that I really liked. Um, the only thing I probably won't use probably as much as the others would be, like, the face oil. Because I have very oily skin. And in general, I don't put a lot of moisturizers on it. I have like a moisturizer that I just use constantly and it works for my skin really well. I don't really want to mess that routine up. In general, yeah, I think Ipsy's a really good idea because you can get a lot of products for a little bit of money, especially if you like makeup like I do. You can try all sorts of new things and you don't have to like go out and buy the full size product that can be really expensive if you know what kind of makeup you're getting and it's like a prestige cosmetic. It can take a lot of money. I hope you all enjoyed this video. I'll be doing lots of other random videos throughout my career of this, hopefully. It's not really a career. It's just a hobby. I'm just trying to kill time. You know, life's too short. Put something out there. Make it shine. A lot of the times my videos aren't going to be about makeup. Uh, other things I enjoy are like multiple fandoms like Doctor Who and Sherlock and things like that. And I also am in love with astronomy so you'll see a lot of that probably on this channel it's I'm not looking to be like a scientist or a beauty guru or anything like that I'm just put my own little touch on this stuff because it's whatever floats your boat anyways like thank you guys for watching uh, if you like this video thumbs up if you don't thumbs down hope you all have a great week and that it is as sunny where you are as it is where I am today even though it's been like the first sunny day Pennsylvania has had in a while this winter. And yeah, bye.